We're going to quickly jump into using the software here with the app for billing. We see we've got a number of jobs that haven't been billed in nearly a month. And we're going to click on the third one and jump right into billing our customer with a draw request. Verifying the dates and then quickly jumping down to the amount to bill this period. As I enter and I scroll across my percents change, I can see my percent complete. I go down to the next line, put in that amount to bill, and I do the same thing. Scroll across, verifying percent, and move it on through to the third line. I'll finish that up. Look on the upper right for my totals, hit save, and then click form so that I can generate this invoice to send to my customer. You see, I got a variety of formats there. I'm going to click preview. And I've got page one of our standard, standard billing form with on the lower right the amount currently due and the balance to finish. Then I'm going to scroll to the second page, which has got my billing items or my schedule of value line items with the schedule value previously billed, billed this period, et cetera, et cetera. I can email that out or print it, forward it. And now we're going to hop out of that screen, go back to our dashboard, and I'm going to focus on paying our vendors now. I go to my unapproved invoices. These are invoices waiting in my approval queue. I saw that there was one for a job. I'm going to quickly get to that grid. You can see I've got the list of invoices with more detail. And I'm looking at the vendors and the names. However, I want to see the invoice description, so I'm going to easily drag him over. And I can see what these are for. I click on one that's most relevant. He's for a job. He's highlighted. You can see down on the lower grid, I've got the distribution now. I'm checking the phase code. I'm happy with that. If I wanted to, I could see the invoice, but for now, I'll just click Approve, and he will move on down our accounts payable line to be paid to the vendor. There you have it. How quickly it is to get from your dashboard into the processes that you've got to do so you can get in and out of the software and back to running your jobs. Thanks for joining us. We appreciate your time. Bye-bye.